president who attended an event in Hambantota extended an invitation to the opposition leader. Ammetanadi Saji Premadasa Maitu Maitru Sampurna Vipakshyang Illi Makkarno Denghari I'd like to invite Saji Premadasa and members of the opposition to join us and work together to solve the problems with the people of this country. Then they can say that they also helped the president. We request everyone to unite. There is no point in presenting false arguments. That method has failed. We can talk to the speaker and make arrangements for more responsibilities to be given to them. Please support the government. We will not let anything threaten the title of the opposition leader. The Samagi John Balavega said that an election should be held before they extend the support the president expects from them. Why should we support the government? We must clearly state that it is a joke that a party which made this country go bankrupt now extends an invitation for us to work together with them while creating an environment for us to work together. The first step to be taken is to get a new public mandate. We must tell the president that if he wants to work with us, he should give space for the mandate of the people. We do not want to be a supporter of the SLPP, terminate all deals with the Raj Bakshis and dissolve the parliament. The parliament has no power. Rana will become a singer to dissolve the existing parliament and take steps for a new parliament to be appointed. However, he is not ready for a discussion. How many times has he said the same thing? He is scared to actually do it. If there is a proper arrangement, we are fine with having a discussion. We would like to know what he wants to talk about. President Vikram Singh has said that Sajid Premadasa can become president if he supports him. What does this mean? He is hinting that he won't run for the next presidential election. The person who accidentally became president will stay on until the very end to enjoy the perks of the title. He is saying that he will not be supporting Sajid. Supporters of the SLPP do not understand this. Politically analyze this statement. This was the response of the General Secretary of the Sri Lanka Podu Chana Peramuna. We have appointed Rani Vikram Singh as the president of the country based on the needs of the country at the time. We have not come to any agreement regarding the matter of what to do next for the remaining term of Gotabi Raj Baksha. But we know that Rani Vikram Singh believes that our country can be developed through a new liberal economic system. Sajid Premadas is the person having that opinion forward. The president may have the idea of Sajid Premadas taking over after him, but I am not aware of that. I also saw this fact in today's newspapers. However, during the upcoming presidential election, our party will propose a leader who can boost the national economy of this country, the position of president. It is not who he is, but what policies he agrees with. The Sri Lanka Pudjana Perumna will support only those who agree with his policies for the upcoming presidential election. United National Party Chairman Vajrabe Vardhana elaborated on the matter. It is important to understand the president's speech. He did not speak about accepting the post of Prime Minister. The message to the opposition leader was the position will be protected, but both the opposition and the government must work together when it comes to national issues. He also said, if there is any aspiration to become the president, Assistance will be given. I see it as something being told to a child. We need to bring all the political parties together. We cannot solve this by simply uniting with the breakaway factions. The People's Tomorrow convened a media briefing. There are two factions in the country. One is the people and the other represents the political parties that are against the people. Who called President Rani Vikramasinghe the bank thief? Who called him the worthless Tarzan? 
or those in Sri Lanka Podujana Peramuna who said such things voted to give Ranil Vikramasinghe the power to decide on the economy. How can the person they termed as useless become worthy today? Did he follow a three-month training program?